Hey guys, let's see if you can solve this equation. So we are going to solve the first equation and often when we see a lot of decimals, we feel intimidated. Let's write down this equation again and see how to solve this. So I have written down this equation and now what I would like to do is I would like to first find out the like terms. So I can see that the constants are like and what we can do to solve them further is we can try to just write our constants on one side and then our terms with the variables. So I can write negative 4x minus 3x and then I can bring 6x to the other side by adding 6x which gives me negative 4x minus 3x and plus 6x on the left side. And then I can try to take my constants on the other side. You can see that 6.5 was negative. So I can add 6.5 on both sides. And similarly, I can add 1.6 on both sides and 9.8 was already on the right side. So this way you have separated your terms. The terms with variables are on the left side. If you solve them, you get negative 7x plus 6x. And the terms which are just constants are on the right side and if you add those up you will get 17.9 negative 7x plus 6x gives you negative x now remember you cannot leave your answer in a negative variable so you will multiply both sides by negative 1 and when you multiply by negative 1 on both sides you get x equals to so let's write this down times negative 1 and this gives you x equals to negative 17.9. I hope this small lesson was helpful and this will allow you to practice more equations. Now go ahead and try this equation by yourself and I will see you in the next video with more math related topics. See you later. Bye for now.